here in the second quarter. We've played a little over two and a half minutes now. And Duncan gets it to go in. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're reeling, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. Here's Bowes following the basket by Tim Duncan. It's good, and the San Antonio lead is cut down to just eight points on the bucket from Muggsy Bowes. Parker outside. Passes to Duncan. With some arc. Harry Johnson grabs the miss. Johnson's got four rebounds now tonight. Into the lane. And the slam Johnson. dunk by Johnson. He may not have that traditional power forward build, but his bounce, well, that kind of levels the playing field. Here's Bowen. Covered by Wingate. Pass to Barry. Oh, good on the triple. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. And that one drops. And now it's just a four-point San Antonio lead. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. Now the pass to Bowen. Here's the floater. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. Bowen's got seven points. And Bowen is selective when it comes to shooting, but there, showing some assertiveness inside. Parker against Bowes. He dishes it to Johnson. And Parker with the block, and he's able to get it back. Here's Gill, just two to shoot, and the rebound collected by Ori. San Antonio leading by six. Inside, Duncan. That's him. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. Duncan's gotten five of his seven shots to fall. Bogues the pass to Gaddison. Here's Gill. Pass to Gaddison. And Tim Duncan gets the whistle that time. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. You know what? Tried to step in and cut him off, but just didn't get there quick enough. Ozzie Muhammad's checked in for San Antonio. The Hornets also with a sub. Morning's checked in for Johnson. Spurs on defense. Now Bowles. Eight points for him. Five to shoot to the left wing. Gaddison passes to Bowes. Here's Gill. And it's out of bounds. The Hornets able to retain possession here. Here is Wingate, still without a basket. Six on the shot clock, passes it to Bowes. Gets it to go from Lugsy beyond Bose. the arc. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You gotta show some fire and keep defending. So it's the Spurs now, following the three by Charlotte. And there's the feed to Parker. Made that one only his fourth of this game after firing ten times from the floor. Saw the angles and led him right to the hoop with that pass. Now here's Bowes. He's got 11. High post morning. Kicks it to Bowes. Poke loose. That's out of bounds to the Hornets as Charlotte retains possession. Ana Ginobili's checked in for a minute. And a switch here also for Charlotte. Newman's checked in. And so here's Charlotte. They trail by seven. And maybe he thinks he 
has that type of range, but I'm not sure who'd agree with him. Yeah, and you're not going to just have the green light for long if you're chucking up bombs like that. Oh, here's Parker. He's got nine. And oh boy, a lot of contact Bugsy there, Bugs. but he gets the call and will shoot two. Second Bugsy Bogues picks one up. Yeah, and Parker just puts so much pressure on your defense with his speed, and he's made a living out of doing that. The Spurs shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one misses. Charlotte making some changes. Curry comes in for Gill. And Bennett subbed in for Bogues. And he ends up missing both free throws. Hornets trail by seven. Curry looking around. Pass to Newman. Yep, it counts. Johnny Newman's Newman. got his second basket. And that's what he does. I mean, he is a bucket getter. Parker inside. Bennett's there. And that one's good. Parker. Look how Parker moves against the contact, acting with such confidence to get his shot. The pass to Newman. Driving inside. The layup missed. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D avoided fouling and got in perfect position to alter that shot. Parker's shot is off. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off a shot, but that might have been what threw him off and made him miss. The putback. Yeah, and Morning's just a beast on the glass, using that muscular frame to get into prime position there on the board. Ginobili outside from downtown. The Hornets pull it in. And here's Bennett. Teardrop shot. Yes, that goes in. Tony Bennett makes up for a lack of speed with just tremendous effort and hustle on that play. Curry against Ginobili. Parker with a clean look. Off target from three-point range. Yeah, that's a shame because I'm not sure the defense will let him get a shot that good again very soon. The shot by Newman, no good. The right thing there to stay that tight on him and, and really try to keep him out of his comfort zone. Yeah, a lefty and, and kind of a tweener position-wise. Just a funky matchup. Ginobili has these big nights, and there's just not much you can do to stop him. Charlotte's foul. Johnny Newman. First personal foul. Third team foul. The Spurs have shot five of eight from the foul line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he can't get the first one. Good on the second free throw. Hornets trail by six. Outside Curry. Pass to Bennett. A floater. It doesn't go for him. Excellent D there from Parker. Ginobili outside. 
from outside the arc. Offensive rebound, Spurs. Here's Muhammad. And Morning sends it back. Curry on the wing. Stolen by Ginobili. Here's Bowen. He's got seven. Picks it out to Ginobili. Good for another basket. He's put up ten shots and made seven of them. Used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. Newman, the pass to Gaddison. At the top of the key, Curry. Pass to Newman. There's the triple. Here's Morning. And there's two points. Working on the glass, paying off that time. Morning's got four points this quarter. Spurs leading by six. Ginobili the pass to Orr. Here's Bowen. Spurs working the ball around now. Parker outside. Six to shoot. Over Bennett. Parker's shot is off. Hornets trail by six. Two free throws Spurs coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Bowen. First it's on Bruce Bowen. Bowen. Third team foul. This Shooting is his first shot. free throw of the game. Jimmy Newman taking two shots. First free throw is good. And the Hornets making a change here. Johnson's checked in. So after making the first, he goes one for two. Spurs leading by five. 104 left in the first half of the game. And plenty of contact on the shot. So, two free throws coming up. That's a foul on Charlotte. The Spurs have hit six free throws in ten attempts. Two shots. And the first one drops. And whether he's starting or coming off the bench, Ginobili makes an impact. The, the type of player any team would love to have. Both free throws good from Ginobili. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. 56 seconds left in the first half. Outside Curry. Just five on the clock. Launches a three. Rebound San Antonio. Ginobili's got rebound number five here tonight. That's in for his eighth bucket tonight. A hot eight for 11 shooting so far. This man has entered the zone. Great shooting performance from him all game long. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Right side curl. He kicks it to Bennett. Pass to Newman. Pulls it up. Charlotte no good that time either. Ori with it. 
Here's Parker, and Morning sends it back. And so it's the San Antonio Spurs. Ahead by nine as the quarter comes to a close. They're pounding the ball inside. That's where they've gotten their best production tonight. And we've got more in 2K Sports coming your way after this break. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Greetings to each and every one of you watching at this very moment. Uh, I'm Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is here. Shaq is here. One half is behind us. Welcome to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. The first quarter was all about Manu Ginobili. He ended up with 19 points, two steals, and one block. And Shaq, what are your thoughts on how San Antonio played? Well, they've shown a lot of discipline in the offensive end. It's not about getting quick shots, it's about getting the good shot. And if you want to know how that approach is working, just check out their field goal percentage. Kenny, what was your takeaway on Charlotte? They haven't been able to get anything going on the offensive end. And the lack of production doesn't just fall on the shoulders of the players. The game plan that the coaches have, it's whack. It doesn't work. And that's a wrap. With the third quarter approaching, we now send you back to Kevin and the crew. And we've got third quarter of basketball for you. Two quarters in the books. It's been one outstanding game from Mono Ginobili. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate with within the first few quarters. I like how they came into this one with a game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. And for those of you just tuning in, thanks for being with us. The second half of this game still to play. On the court for the Hornets, Gill is out there with Bogues. And there's Bennett, and it's Wingate, and it's Morning in at the five. Stolen. Gill the pass to Bowes. Here is Wingate. Back to Bogues. Duncan with the block. He's the defensive anchor for this team. Duncan excels at reading shooters and then altering their shots. Now here's Parker. Back to Duncan. Duncan drawing the double team. Here's the three. Hands it from downtown. Bowen's got the lead up to 12 now for the Spurs. And this is Bowen's specialty on offense. A legit threat from beyond the arc. Then at the pass to Gill. feet out and he hits it. Gill's got five. Spurs leading by ten. Right around a minute and a half. Play here in the third quarter. And there's the whistle. Illegal screen. That's going to draw a whistle every time down the floor. Not even close to the illegal screen. That's a very avoidable turnover. you got to focus on the details. Johnson, he's checked in for Bennett. Here's Gill. Duncan with the block. Parker against Bogues. Boom. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Parker. 12 points for him. It's harder to thread those passes inside, but the reward is evident. Bogues the pass to Gill. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Here's Morning. A rebound by the Spurs. Duncan's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And it's Mono Ginobili with the finish. Merciless drive by Ginobili. If there's a weakness in your defense, he'll find it. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Here's Johnson. And the Hornets miss again. Yeah, and smothered him on that mid-range attempt. That's how you play it. Does a good job of getting into the shooter's airspace. Bowen, the pass to Duncan. Oh. 
score the basket. It's number six for him this game. Six for nine, 67% shooting. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. Oh, yeah, you out. think you got to stop, and it's wasted because of sloppy work on the glass. You literally practice that every day. Charlotte calls timeout. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. I'm sure Coach is going to give them an earful about that. He can't be happy with that soft interior D. the best of morning. Here's Gill. Now morning. He's got eight. There's the pass to Gill. Four on the shot clock. Over Ginobili. Tim Duncan grabs the miss. Duncan's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. The shot's good. Bowen's got seven points for the quarter. And that lead pass allowed him to get straight to the rim, unabated, in stride. To the middle, here's Johnson. Shot to stop the run. At basket number six Larry to his stat sheet. He's now six for ten. Well, the, the pick didn't exactly neutralize the defender, but, but good concentration on the finish to still get the basket. Oh, here's Parker. He's got 12. And there's Ginobili. That's good on the assist by Parker. Ginobili's got 23 points. Ooh, he's earning his keep offensively, a key part of their winning effort at this point. Bogues the pass to Johnson. Over Duncan. And it's off the back rim. No good. And here's Duncan. He'll bring it up for the San Antonio Spurs. 18 points separating the teams. That's the biggest lead of the game. Now here's Ginobili. Pass to Bowen. Now Muhammad. To the paint. Here's Parker over Bowes. And the Spurs scoring again. Boy, you have to be impressed with the offensive production. They have got it firing on all cylinders. They've had great execution. And what stands out is that they're just taking what the defense gives them, not forcing anything. That's good, and so Duncan with the assist. Duncan's got his fourth assist in this one. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Spurs. They've been defending with excellent anticipation all game long. Just look at how many times they've managed to get their hands on the ball. And another place they're finding success is in transition. They've been working hard to get ahead of the defense and find those easy personal foul. First team has gone two for two at the line so far. Shooting for Charlotte. Larry Johnson, two shots. Shooting two. And that one falls for Johnson. The Spurs making a switch here. Barry's checked in. He's perfect from the line this time. Here's Parker. He's got 16. Ginobili outside. And 
It's good. Ginobili's got six in the quarter. They're taking it right into the teeth of the defense, and it's a defense that's starting to look frustrating. That's the kind of aggression you want to see when you've got a team on the ropes. And the Hornets call time here. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, they need to regroup and maybe try and draw something up that can get them a clean look at the basket. against Bobes. Wound up there for Johnson, and Muhammad sends it back. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Kevin, thanks very much. Well, the NBA is investing in Africa with the Basketball Africa League. Deputy Commissioner Mark Tatum said right now in Africa, sports is viewed only as competition, not as a business. What we're trying to demonstrate is that if you invest in sports, with the young, fast-growing population in Africa, there is a huge opportunity for high returns. Kevin? Yeah, it looks, D.A., like a win-win. And we thank you for your report. That free throw, no good. Or he's checked in for the Spurs. Gaddison, he's checked in for the Hornets. And he sinks the second. Here's Charlotte now. Here's Gill. He's got five. Now here's Bowes. Down low. Gaddison misses. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D, avoided fouling, and got in perfect position to alter that shot. Here's Bowen. Ginobili outside. Shot clock at six. And he banks in the lane. Ginobili's got 27. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. Now, here's Johnson. 16 points for him. It's really just a great play to sacrifice his body and take the charge. Curry's checked in for the Hornets. Del Curry. And they are really racking up the assists in this one. And their team chemistry is evident. These guys enjoy playing with one another. Here's Barry. Hasn't made one yet. He feeds it to Muhammad. The rebound by Johnson. Johnson's got six rebounds in the game. Passes it to Gill. That's in there. Johnson with the assist. Gill's got four points now in the quarter. And that's why you don't let them get positioned deep in the post. And they need better team defense. How about your man in the post? It takes multiple guys to stop him. Bowen shot is off. Johnson against Orr. 
Pass to Bogues. Fires from deep. Gill misses. Spurs leading by 23. And here is Ginobili. He's got 27. Now the pass to Bowen. Puts up a deep three. They get it back. And the basket by Muhammad. There he is, beasting on the glass, converting the opportunity, trying to put this game away. Always giving max effort on the glass, taking everything they'll give him. Bogues rejected by Ginobili. And he recovers it. Bogues, Bogues in among the big players. Hits the shot. And so it's Ginobili bringing it up now for the San Antonio Spurs. Pass to Bowen. Out left to the wing. Here's their Hornets foul. Kenny Dennison. Tim Duncan, he's checked in for Muhammad. Foul. The Hornets also with Second the sub. Foul. Newman's checked in for both. Substitution Bowles. on the court. Here's Ginobili. This is a to Bowen. Another shot. Duncan misses. Here's Johnson. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle. And now a three-point play chance here for him. Personal foul. I tell you what, what a good thing that he showed up today because without him, this thing would already be over. So far, he's hit all of his shots at the foul line, going four for four. One shot. That's good from Johnson. San Antonio leading by 20. Here's Barry. Still scoreless. Over to the left wing. Ori gets the bucket. And I love whenever Ori rises up from there. His jump shot is so pure. The D has to respect him. Ginobili against Gill. Pass to Newman. To the wing right side. Charlotte moving it around. Here's the teardrop. Johnson can't get it to go. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. This is why he's out there in situations like this. He stands tall to prevent points. And you're not going to pass up that kind of Gill against Ginobili. The pass to Johnson. Fires for three. Makes that one fall. It's his eighth bucket in 15 shot attempts. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You got to show some fire and Two keep them in. in the third. Two now minutes. here's Jano. He's got 27. And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. And he has to take that Substitution long, slow three. walk back to the bench here. He he'll watch the rest of this one from the sideline. And some changes here for the Spurs. Muhammad comes in for Duncan. And Parker subbed in for Barry. Morning's checked in for Charlotte. Bennett comes in for Gill. Bennett with it. Covered by Parker. Bennett dishes to Curry. 144 and left in the third. Bennett the pass to Newman. And again, the Hornets missing. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. Yeah, him right now. This He's just like in his Parker. own head. Not much you can do to try and push through it. Here's Newman following the bucket by the Spurs. Up top, Bennett. Here's Newman. He's got five. And Muhammad sends it back. Johnson against Orr. To the inside. Here's Muhammad. Morning with some nice D. 
Muhammad's gotten just one of six shots to fall here. San Antonio foul. Bruce Bowen. Second personal foul. Third team This foul. is his second trip to the free throw line. Shooting for Charlotte. Johnny Newman at the line for two. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. Both good from the line that time. 55 seconds left to play in the third. Here's Parker. And they'll get another chance. Muhammad pass to Bowen. Curry against Ginobili. Lock at six. Tries again. And Morning sends it back. Here's Newman. And that one is stuffed right through. Nice ball movement there. Delivered the pass right on time. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Parker with 16 points for him. 11 feet away. It's rebounded by Charlotte. Johnson's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Here's the try. Count that one. How good is that? I mean, he can make a defender look foolish at times. Let's work at the line so far, going five for five. At the line for one. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. And that one falls for Johnson. Six seconds left here in the third quarter. One second left. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Second personal foul. And, and Ginobili is foul. just fearless. He, he isn't concerned about getting fouled on the way up. The Spurs have made nine free throws in the game. 14 attempts. And he makes the first. Both free throws good from Ginobili. So it's the San Antonio Spurs with an 18-point lead as the quarter comes to a close. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. Now, Bogues. So with Duncan sitting on the bench. Here's how the floor looks for Greg Popovich. We've got Ori. Ginobili is out there with Tony Park. Then there's Muhammad, and it's Bowen in at the threesome. Now here's Ginobili. to Orr. 
Parker outside. Six on the shot clock. Second chance shot. A putback. Great positioning on the putback. And the Spurs lead by 20. That is really good work there on the offensive glass. Now, here's Bogues. Rebounded by the Spurs. Muhammad's got his 16th rebound on the night. Ginobili against Curry. Ginobili the pass to Muhammad. And yes, it's good. Muhammad's got four points now in the quarter. We played just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Passes to Morning. Second shot opportunity. He lays it in. Alonzo Morning. And he's now got the double double. 10 points and 11 rebounds. And how about the strength from Morning powering through the contact and converting there? Pass to Muhammad. Here's Bowen. And it's San Antonio with another. And really the story of this second half. One team getting the shots they want. The other, not so much. And start with their defense. They've been intense on that end. And they can actually help their offense as well. Sharpshooter Del Curry hits the three. Three. He can really stroke it from deep. You have to keep better tabs on him. And here is Parker. Muhammad pass to Bowen. Shot clock at five. Looking to end his cold spell. And the Spurs scoring again. Yeah, the pick and roll is a deadly thing when Parker gets involved like there. You never know what he's going to do. Bogues against Parker. Again, the Hornets Multiple. score. Taking full advantage of a gap in the mid-range coverage. Spurs leading by 19. Ginobili looking around. With the teardrop, a stupendous finish in track. Ginobili's got 31. Yeah, that's some slick ball handling on his way to the hoop there, guys. Crossed him over and slid right by him. Hornets trail by 21. Bogues the pass to Kirk. To the paint. And Wingate gets it to go. Used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. And so it's Ginobili bringing it up now for the San Antonio Spurs. Earlier in the game, they held a 25-point lead. Now here's Parker. And there's the pass to Muhammad. Ginobili, that's for two. They get it back. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. First personal foul. First team foul. At the line for San Antonio, Nazi Mohammed. Two shots. That one is off. Gill is checked in for Curry. He hits the second from the line. Hornets trail by 20. Bogues the pass to Wingate. Bogues against Parker. Now here's Bogues. Not a lot of room. Good D by Parker. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. 
This is why he's out there. In situations like this, he stands tall to prevent points. Once again off the mark by San Antonio. Here are the Hornets with the ball. Here's Johnson, and then Johnson with the jam. Rate of baskets Monty assisted, balls. it's a stat I really like. It tells the story of how well you are playing team offense. Bogues against Parker. Ginobili outside. Plays it up and banks it in. Ginobili's got 14 points now in the second half. Really, really good at recognizing the gaps and getting the ball to the rim. Pass to Gill. Over Ginobili. Johnson kicks to Bogues. Poked away. Tries to save it. And out of bounds as the Spurs gain possession. against Bogues. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. And Parker's just extremely clever at getting fouls off those kinds of shots. At the line for San Antonio, Tony Parker. The first one falls. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Here's Gill. Passes it to Bowes. Excellent D there from Parker. San Antonio leading by 22. Picked his pocket. To the middle. Pass break. Here we go. And Johnson with the stuff. And that all started with the sleight of hands there by Gill. Excellent with his hand-eye coordination. And that's how you get out in transition. San Antonio calls timeout. Ginobili outside. Outside, Ori. Bogues against Parker. Five on the clock. Johnson with the block. Bogues against Parker. Now, here's Bogues. Defense right on him. Floater. Oh, that's blocked. And they're able to recover. Goes back up. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. To Larry Johnson. Spurs leading by 18. 
Ginobili outside. Inside. Bogues against Parker. Down to five on the shot clock. That one doesn't drop. Hornets trail by 18. Pass to Johnson. Here is Wingate. Johnson, the pass to Gill. Back to Johnson. And he makes good on the layup. Larry Johnson. Johnson's got 31 points. Be a good looking bounce pass to set up that one. Ginobili against Gill. Here's Parker with the three. Nailed from three point land. And that's a nice jump shot there by Parker. Caught it right in rhythm. Bogues against Parker. Bogues the pass to Gill. The pass to Wingate. And here's Bogues. And another three for Charlotte. Bogues. The real. Come at us, and we're coming right back at you. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You drain a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. Mohammed and the powerful one-handed slam. That gives him a double-double in this one. Ten points and 18 rebounds. Just a great playmaking sequence by Parker there, coming away with the assist. Here's Gill. Kept alive. Here's Johnson. And the refs are going to rule that unnecessary contact. It's a flagrant one foul. And Kevin, the that's line, a the pretty Hornets. dangerous play Larry right there. Johnson. I mean, I don't like to see Taking a player put an opponent in harm's way. As much as you just saw him do there, glad they pinned a, a flagrant on him. Yeah, you're right, Greg. The officials were all over it. They weren't going to let him off the hook that time. He misses the free throw. And he's good on the second. Charlotte moving it around. Bogues against Muhammad. Larry Johnson Larry finishes Johnson. off the alley-oop with power. And, and maybe that'll trigger them. Impossible not to get pumped up after that. Yeah, well, you can see the immediate reaction of the guys on the bench. They are pumped up. It's Parker with the drop. And Morning sends it back. Bogues against Muhammad. Now, here's Bogues. He's tightly guarded. And Muhammad sends it back. Ginobili with the ball. And Muhammad kicks to Parker. Count the basket. Parker's got 25 points in the game. Yeah, and really, Parker is scoring the ball extremely well right now. Hard to slow him down when he's this high. Down low. And the basket Larry by Johnson. Johnson. That's 36 ball. points for Johnson. Hill. Used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. Now Parker. Pass to Muhammad. Knocked loose. And stolen by Morning. To the inside. There's Larry Johnson Larry on the assist Johnson. by Bogues. Bogues has got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Now here's Parker. Two minutes remaining. Passes it to Bowens. Ginobili bounce pass. Five to shoot. It's Parker outside. Gill with the rebound. Gill's got four rebounds in this game. Trying to find Johnson. He's got it now. And the call on the shot sends him to the line. First personal foul. That one on Ginobili. Second team foul. At the line for the Hornets. 
Larry Johnson. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And both free throws good for Johnson. 141 left in the fourth quarter. Ginobili up top. He's covered by Gill. Shot from 12. Gill with the rebound. And the defense was all over him once he got in close. Didn't want him to get too comfortable. He dents the rim with a two-hand slam. Wow. Oh, fellas, that was vicious two-hand monster slam. Guys, I don't think there was anyone who could have stopped him on that one. Muhammad against Morning. Here's Ginobili. No good, unable to end this run. Hornets trail by nine. There's a minute left in the fourth quarter. And stolen by Ori. Bogues against Parker. Drops in the layup for two. And the Spurs lead by 11. That one's going to be the final dagger. And these guys can now celebrate. Market time of death. Does that mean we get to officially enter garbage time? I vote hopefully yes. Here's both. And he buries that one, Bones. drilling the rim on the way down. And pro move there. Finds a way to gain some separation against the much taller defender. Okay, look. That move right there is a product of repetition. He's worked on that, and it pays off over that little larger defender. Johnson against Orr. Shot clock at six. Parker against Bogues. Parker's shot is off. Here's Gill. Here's Morning. Off the mark. And so it's San Antonio with the win. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. Yeah, I mean, it was a solid performance, uh, particularly here at home. Uh, I think they built off that edge of being here and, and play with just a little more confidence than their opponent. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. This is Kevin Harlan saying thank you for watching. See you next time.